What's up everybody, Danny's here and we are back at it again with another video. But before we get into it, make sure you check out all the links in the description below. And yes, it's February and I realized the Nintendo Direct was delayed on February 7th and they're going to plan to announce it by February 14th or on the 15th or the 13th. We may need to figure this out because as I can tell, the next Nintendo Direct might possibly be announced by February 13th, which is Tuesday, tomorrow, or either Wednesday, February 14th. So we may have to figure this out. And y'all know that the next Nintendo Switch games we want to see is Metroid Prime 4. Um, I've talked about this a lot recently. Metroid Prime 4, Zelda Wind Waker, and Twilight Princess. So, our Xbox... Like, you know with Xbox, I thought the Xbox was going to discontinue, but it's still going. The Xbox Series X, it's still continuing. And somehow, some Xbox games might be ported to PlayStation and Nintendo Switch. But it might be a copyright, to be honest with you. But you know, one good thing about Xbox, though, is Xbox Game Pass. And even though digital games like do you think xbox should release a digital version of the xbox series x because i believe the xbox series s is a digital version but the xbox series x is a physical version but will nintendo release their next console or the next nintendo switch with a digital version and you guys may need to help me out because as i can tell playstation released a digital edition console which is so cool to see without the disc selection, without the disc insert, like with the original Wii. I mean, that ain't possible, but I believe Nintendo might announce the Switch 2 with a digital version. This may seem possible with the Nintendo and the Nintendo Switch itself because it's life cycle with gaming because literally like with physical games digital games we sometimes lose them and get digital games instead but right now we've seen a lot of people talking about this and now i've seen this far worse than any other people in times of gaming which is legitimate the point of losing games which is it my favorite at this point sometimes we regret doing losing stuff and we have to buy digital. Like that's not fair if we lose things. To Just to be honest with you. So I bet Nintendo might announce the Switch 2 with a digital version. With no game card slot. Because we may have like. I don't know what, what we're going to do. As much as I know Nintendo would actually release the digital version of their next console. Now personally I love buying physical games. Because the game box art, the cartridge itself, sometimes they're not able to access. Like, sometimes Nintendo Switch consoles can't access game cards. Which means I just feel annoyed as possible. But I might play some Mario games while Mario vs. Don Mario vs. Donkey Kong comes to the Nintendo Switch. Now, personally, that it should be a good idea, to be honest with you. Or play more Fortnite, because it's been a while. And um, Season 5 might be coming pretty soon. And the original Fortnite map, I haven't talked about this in a while. The OG Fortnite map has rumors. It may be releasing later this year. Either like in March. But Fortnite was originally released in December, September 2017. Like originally released on Xbox, PlayStation, and PC. And it released later on with the Nintendo Switch. I believe Epic Games might have continued making more content update, but they just want to do more similar type game. And Nintendo could, like, could scratch that. But Nintendo could, like, make some more content update. But personally, I believe the next Nintendo Direct will be perfect as it is. Because I would see it as an opportunity with all these people looking for new content. And that might be the biggest point of Nintendo itself. It's life cycle though. Because we may find out if Nintendo is going to release the Switch 2 with either a physical version or a digital version. So yeah, that was my 
thoughts on what Nintendo will announce on the next Nintendo Direct. So, um, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. And if you guys do enjoy this video, please make sure you give this video a thumbs up button. Thank you all so much for watching. Leave a comment below. And also subscribe if you're new. And I'll see you guys next time.